This step-by-step -step instruction video gives you the information you need to connect your cable box or your satellite receiver or your HDTV tuner or your Blu-ray or regular DVD player or your computer or DVD player to your television or a computer monitor. We are going to cover the four methods you can use to connect your box to a television. The best method we're going to cover first is HDMI, using an HDMI connection. If you don't have an HDMI connection, then you can use an RGB YPRPB component with two channels of RCA audio, all on RCA connectors. If you don't have either an HDMI or RGB connection, you can connect using standard definition video or S-video and also using two channels of audio. And if none of those methods will work for you, you can use a standard RF connection between your box and your television. This is an HDMI connector on an HDMI cable. You will need to insert your HDMI connector into your box and then take the other end of the connector cable and connect it to the back of your television set. Note that audio is also carried on this cable so you only need this one connection for your television. Please make a note of where you connected to your television. You will need to use your remote control on your television and use the input or source select button and then choose the input you connected to on your television using the input select settings. Sometimes you may need to use a temporary connection so you can see the output of your box because HDMI is not turned on on your box. In this case you will make a temporary video connection from the output of your cable box to the input of the television. This will allow you to set your box to output on HDMI. Once that's done, you go back to using your HDMI cable and remove the video connection. If your picture does not fill the screen properly on your television, you will need to go and adjust your aspect ratio settings on both your box and your television for the correct setting. If you're using a high definition connection like an HDMI or a YPRPB, then you would want to go to 1080i high definition unless your television is only capable of 720p. HDMI and DVI-D connectors are electronically equivalent and are interchangeable by using adapters. If your set is not capable of an HDMI connection, then you will need to use an RGB YPRPB component connection with two channels of RCA audio connections. Make a note of the input you connected your RGB YPRPB connections to on your television and then use your remote and use the source or input button and select the menu that allows you to select the input you connected to on the back of the television. If your particular television does not have RGB or HDMI, then you will have to connect using standard definition video. This is an example of a standard definition video cable with two channels of audio. Yellow is the color always used on televisions to indicate a standard definition composite video signal. And of course you will have to connect the two channels of RCA audio. White is left and red is right. If you have an older television, the only connection available on it will be an RF F connector. This is an F connector. You will connect this cable to your box and then to your television. Then you will have to select your source as tuner and then tuned to channel 3 or 4. 
Thank you for watching this video.